Okay guys, for special snack, we're gonna use a green apple, a couple of chocolate chips, we have a um, sour worm, or you can use a gummy worm, two grapes, and some sun butter. All right, so first thing you're gonna do is, you can either use an apple cutter to cut the apple. I'm gonna just use a knife, because it'll just be easier, just me sitting down. You're going to take like two slices of apple. Did I do it wrong? Excuse me. <laughs> okay. All right. I think we're good. All right. So you're going to take it like this. Maybe I should do it this way. Yes, this will be easier. All right. You're going to put some sun butter or peanut butter if you're not allergic. We're using sun butter because we're at school. You're gonna put it like this on one side of your apple. Okay. And then take your other slice and put it on top. I'm gonna do it actually like this so you guys can see it better. Actually, before you even do that, you can actually go ahead and stick in the little worm because this is gonna be your frog's mouth. So he's eating the worm, oh my goodness. Then up here, which would be where his eyes would be, you're gonna take a little bit more and dab it on your grapes. Stick them on. I'm just gonna see if we've got it with. I'll just hang on. If it falls, it falls. And then the other one, same thing. So your sun butter is kind of acting like your glue. So you're gonna have him like this. These are his eyes. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I don't like that. I'm gonna cut my grapes in half. I think it'll stick better. Just have to go with the flow sometimes when you're cooking and creating snacks. that. Just like that. Other side, just like that. Then, if you have two chocolate chips, which we do, we're going to stick them in the, where the little stem would go on a grape. We're going to stick them right in there. So now you have your beautiful, yummy, and healthy frog face eating a worm snack. Yummy! Hopefully you guys have some of this stuff at home. If not, you can make it with however you, whatever you've got. Just something kind of fun and silly to make to end our week about pond life and pond changes. So have fun and hope you guys have a great weekend. We miss you.